shortcut fight news. Are you ready for glory? Cool Hammers, matchmaker, why did you decide to go exclusive with this event? Well, actually, uh, the main reason was that we have a, a main event, uh, the world title between uh, Wilnes and uh, Pereira. And we uh, had to look for a location over here in Utrecht. We wanted to do this uh, event in Utrecht. And actually, uh, on a short term, this was the only uh, possible uh, studio uh, event venue uh, available. So that's the reason. So it's like a special event for us, but it's also caused because we have this world title file between a guy from Utrecht. And uh, it's, it's about uh, 1,000 places? Yes. Yeah. yes. Well, like it. I like okay. it. A small one. It's a different, you know, from all the time, the same events. Uh, the next event, Barras, Vakin yeah. versus uh, Abena. And Correct. And Dumbe versus uh, Alim Nabiev. That for sure, but uh, in the ideal world uh, I should have made a match between Tavares and Abeda before, but we didn't have the time. Fakitov was injured for a while and now he was ready to fight, so we really need to give him a fight. So I was a little bit in, a, in, a, in an emerge to give him a challenger and that's why we choose for the highest ranked fighter. But if we had more time, then for me I preferred first to have a fight between Abena and Luis Tavares and the, and the winner from that fight. But it's like it is now, and uh, I'm happy that Fagitov is back and ready to fight. They can fight next, either way? Yeah, of course. The, the, this is still an interesting match. Yes, you know, so they, they fought. The yeah, they fought before. Well, this is a dilemma that popped up uh, very recently, so we are discussing internal and there are some uh, meetings with all those guys, so I cannot say anything uh, finally about it, but uh, there will be some news in the, in the short term for sure. But do you think that Rico should respect uh, Jamal at least, because we respected Rico in his tournament, he became a champion, I think he should respect Jamal. Well, I think all fighters should respect each other, but uh, we will see how this uh, ends up. You know, uh, the statement from Rico was like uh, two or three days ago, and uh, I know the wishes of, uh, of Ben Sadek, of course, uh, Badahari signed recently, so it's now really, as we speak, the meetings are taking place. Okay, so you're going to keep us... Uh, yeah. To, you keep you to be honest, I did, don't really know him. <laughs> Where should we know him from, except that he has a fast KO? Well, if you look a lot of television in Germany, then you will look him from some soap series. He's like a kind of a movie star who was popular in the, in the past on television. Yeah. But he's also a, a good sportsman and uh, he's uh, famous actually for his special techniques, which is actually awarded uh, with uh, special points in the glory system. If you have uh, turning kicks and all those kinds of things. He's a specialist in that so we are happy that we could sign him and uh, looking forward to the German market I think he's a, a good add to our uh, roster. We will see then, uh, well good, then we're uh, gonna look him up on YouTube then. Yeah. Uh, where is Guto? I saw he disappeared from the ranking list. Guto Innocent, where is he? Guto uh, had a request to fight uh, outside Glory because he had some uh, other opportunities and we give him the permission and if a fighter is uh, side, uh, fighting uh, for another organization which we allow because they always have to require us but we approve then we for time period we take him out of the ranking so that's a new that's a new thing uh, if he will fight back in glory he will he will keep his points but uh, for now he's out of the ranking okay uh, i have to ask you this because you have three armenian fighters in emership you have marat my son has three, uh, three. Marat, Marat, yeah, Harut. Uh, oh yeah, Yegis, yeah. And Kar Karapetian. Karapet was uh, from before. Uh, he was training under my uh, Karapet coaching. Was still Karat, under your Karat, uh, Karapet was actually a fighter out of the Golden Glory time. Uh, talking about Karapet, uh, I talked to Nick, but it was a while ago. I talked to Yoko, but that was a while ago. But everybody's angry with Karapetian. Oh, me not. Uh, recently he posted that he's interested to make a comeback because now he finished his studies with the law. Okay. Uh, back to glory? I have to check his age at the moment because we're actually looking for new young talent and I think Carapet is in the middle 30s or maybe 37 or something, I don't know, I have to check it and then I don't know how, uh, how his physical condition is, uh, the, did he still uh, did some t do some training or he's still uh, only studying with his law uh, no, thing, you know? So. He finished? Now, yeah. Okay. Oh, he has his own office. That's well, good that he made the right choice, I think. But if we want to go back what? into fighting, yeah, well, we have to see his quality first. But I think he should do a fight first outside of Glory. Yeah. When is Glory 
coming to Yerevan, especially with... Well, there are already uh, some promoters who show interest uh, to have some glory event in Armenia, but uh, that is uh, depending on a lot of other factors like television and all kind of things. But uh, indeed, indeed, they, uh, they are interested. You so. are interested? No, Armenia is interested yeah. to have glory yeah, there. Yeah, but you also personally? Personally, no, it's, it's, uh, we have other key markets at this moment on our, on our focus for this year. So. And when can we see you, Kohemas, uh, on holiday in Armenia, at least with Nick Hammers? Oh, man, that's, uh, that's, uh, I, th that's I have to you. discuss with my wife. You know. Yes, we will invite you all. Uh, okay. Uh, Alex Pereira was training in UFENAP and I saw Josh Johnson yeah. training in Shonderman at their main Do you think this will become a new trend? The fighters uh, when they come to Holland? Sometimes it has to do with the time difference. I don't know how long they are training. If it's not like months, then I don't think it make. If it's a week like this, it will not make any difference. It's just because they find a place to uh, feel themselves comfortable for the time difference. My last question is, uh, uh, what happened with Remy Bojanski and Helena Hendricks of Veronica Chibi? Well, TV, uh, Veronica decided to make it a more like a magazine instead of a studio program, so... Okay, Helena has her own program now. Uh, Not okay, yet, but... Okay, these were my questions. Go uh, uh, success tomorrow night, yeah. of course, and I will be there, and we will always watch Glory. And thank you for the interview. You're welcome. Okay, <laughs>